all right so just got my resupply at the grocery store this is the uh, Warwick drive-in this is where I'm staying the night this is the place that the hikers came back here for free and watched the movie so I'm excited about this tonight and see what's going on and where we camp at and whatnot. I'll get my tent set up if I can. All right, I got my tent all set up over here. I'm gonna walk in, give me something to eat now for lunch. This is the drive in theater. And at nighttime, they give you a radio tuned to like 89.7 or something like that. And you can hear the movies. So they're showing Thor and they're showing uh, the new Jurassic Park, Minions, some new horror movie, and um. Something else I forgot, so. It looks like you've left the route, so I'll reroute you. So, gonna walk up here and get some lunch. There's a barbecue restaurant 1.6 away, but I don't feel like walking that far. There's some other stuff close by. See what I can find. Okay, so I walked over to this Chinese restaurant, which is about 0.2 away. And I got some uh, sesame chicken. Found a picnic table with some shade, so I'm gonna sit here. It is burning hot today. For up north, this is hot. This feels like a Florida day. So I'm gonna find something to do the rest of the afternoon to cool off and go time. I'm laying in my tent and it's raining outside, so I hope it'll blow over pretty quick, but it actually feels really good with that cool breeze from it, so I'm kind of enjoying it. Let's push the side of the tent in here, you can see. Okay, the cars are starting to roll in. We've got a few more hikers that showed up. We have a wise one that she's here. We have um, Star Lord at the end. We have um, Yahtzee, um, Smiles, Little Peak. And there's a couple more coming up. I don't know who they are yet. And uh, there's supposed to be four or five more showing up too. So we should have a pretty good bit tonight. And we're going to show Thor over here in this one. On this screen, I'm not sure what's going to play. Some kind of new movie. And on this one's Minions. Okay, so that's the theater we're watching, and this is how we're listening to it. it Give us the radio. It's a little different, but it works. It's afternoon of day 114. Still here at the movie theater. Got my tent still set up. Brody and all them got in town. They're over there camped. And so, taking a zero day today. And sitting here relaxing. Needed this. So while I was sitting here, uh, one of the other hiker guys, his beard was all trimmed and nice, and I was wondering how he kept it so nice on the trail. He said he went this little place right here in the shopping center, and for 10 bucks they trimmed it up for him. And so they don't do shades, but I said, take your clippers as close as you can. I was glad to get all this gone. It feels so good, because you sweat, it sticks in there, and this is amazing. And I got me some um, popcorn for tonight for the movie kettle corn and I tried this new Mountain Dew it's a uh, Mountain Dew Gold it's really good actually kind of reminiscent of a um, one of those Dum Dum Lollipops the um, cream soda flavored I don't know what it tastes like for me it does so sit and relax and we'll get some Mexican food later on and come back and watch the movies <laughs> alright just finished eating dinner at this Mexican place behind me here and it was uh, disappointing. The food was not very good. Salsa and chips were good, but the food just had a weird flavor to it. I don't know. If some was, hopefully it wasn't bad or nothing, but it just didn't taste right. So heading back to the theater now. Going to get me a drink for a head back. Maybe an ice cream cone or something. And then uh, ready for the movie. All right. We are back at the theater again. Night number two. Took a zero today. So I'm turning the camera. Yeah, it's a this place is getting pretty busy. Is there all the hiker trash back here? Hi, hiker trash. <laughs> I own it. <laughs> it's so good. Everybody's all over here. So, hanging out. All right, it's morning, day 115. Got a hitch out of Warwick finally, broke the vortex of town. Uh, I'm back on trail. A nice trail maintainer uh, is heading into the city today, so he saw us, asked if we need a ride, and dropped us off, so that was wonderful. 
So here we are back in the heat, hiking today, it's supposed to be really hot today, 104 temperature they're calling for. So it's going to be a Florida feeling day today. Finally get some good hot weather. I like the heat, so anyway, back on trail, I'll see you at lunchtime or at camp or whatever else I see. All right, let me show you this, turn the camera around here. I am officially in New York. I was in New York last night technically, but I took a car ride in from the trail into Warwick. But now I've hiked into New York. Hello, Big Apple. I'm coming to you. I got about five more days, six days, four days, give or take. Somewhere on that range, I'll be in New York City. So I hiked up top of this mountain. And there's an old American flag waving in the wind. Weathered and torn, but it's still waving. I like seeing that. That's pretty cool. I don't know if you can see this on video, but let me zoom in. Way over here in the distance is New York City. And that ridge way over there, probably not invisible. But that's New York City skyline. It's probably beautiful up here at nighttime. You probably see it better. But anyway, that's where we're heading in a couple of days. Now here is the Hudson River. And the far right distance is the New York skyline. This is fantastic. And this is the trail today. Got to go up this, and there's the blade. Then we go left, we go up. All this. It's gonna be a fun rock scramble. All right, we got these pieces of rebar stuck in the concrete or granite, whatever you call it, rock. We gotta climb up this now. Another view of the Hudson. Getting closer to it. We cross it before too long. New York is over there, city anyway, other side of that, can't see anymore, but getting closer.